So the game I'm playing today is called Multiwinia. As the name would insinuate, this is the multiplayer version of Darwinia. Now you guys already know that I played Darwinia last week, and even though I thought it was very slow-paced, a little too slow-paced for my liking, I, I still enjoyed it for what it was. It was the first game introversion ever released, as far as I'm aware, and it was a pretty good first attempt. But this right here is the multiplayer version of Darwinia, so long story short, there is a single-player mode in this game, which means I don't need to worry about finding a multiplayer server because we're not gonna bother with the multiplayer mode. We're just gonna try out some of these single-player games here. And I have played some of the tutorials off-screen, so I do already know how the game works. Basically, in this game, you're making Darwinians fight each other. There's no viruses that you have to destroy, or even snakes, or weird floating tentacle monsters. No, the Darwinians are basically fighting each other. Multiwinia was released in 2008, a few years after Darwinia came out. It plays very similar to Darwinia. A lot of the gameplay mechanics from Darwinia do make their return. A lot of the programs that you can create in the original Darwinia are still in this game, but they are in the form of crate drops now, so they're like upgrades that you get occasionally during the game. So the engineers do make a return, and even though I didn't encounter them in the tutorial, I'm pretty sure the scouts are in this game as well. There's also a bunch of new upgrades too, such as airstrikes and armor. Uh, armor is not what you think it is, it's not like armor f for the Darwinians, like armor that the Darwinians wear. It's actually a ship that can carry Darwinians from one point to another, so kind of a misleading name. There's also gigantic turrets that you can get from the crates as well, that just annihilate everything in its path. So we're gonna get into all of that very soon, so I think for now we are just going to go to a single player game. So we do have six different game modes here, none of which I played off screen at all, the only ones I played are the uh, tutorial games, that's all I played off screen. So we do have Domination, King of the Hill, Capture the Statue, Assault, Rocket Riot, and Blitzkrieg. So Domination, overwhelm the entire map and destroy all enemy teams to win. Occupy and hold the zones around the map to score points. Each one controlled by you will score you one point per second, which is King of the Hill. Capture the statue, lift heavy statues dotted around the map and carry them back to your base to score points. Assault, assault to heavily defend the position and capture a WMD before it detonates and everybody dies. Uh, rocket Riot, capture solar panel arrays to refuel your rocket, protect your rocket as you prepare to launch. First team to launch is the winner, and then Blitzkrieg, capture crucial flag points around the map. So maybe we'll just go with uh, Domination for now, just, uh, just to get started easily on this. I don't know if I'm going to play every single game mode in this video. We do have a bunch of different locations, though. Uh, the Eternal Guardians, Hamburger Hill, uh, Barriers, Progress, Shine of Memory, yada yada yada. Um, there, there does appear to be some locations that have more than one team on them, like Holy Tree and a Monument to the Heavens has like four teams on them. But... Let's, let's just start simple here. I think I'll go to Hamburger Hill, just because of the name here. And I can actually change my name here, too. Oh, wait. Oh. I didn't know that. I can also change my, my color. Okay, well, hang on a second. I wanna I do want to change my name here. Just change it to what I normally use, Robotnik35. There we go. Very good indeed. I don't know if that's going to change the uh, color of my Darwinians, though, but I guess we'll wait and see. AI type, I guess I could just set to normal for now, and let's just, uh, well, actually, advanced, advanced mode. Um, maybe I'll just put the time limit to 5, just so that maybe I can try and, uh, show off all of these game modes here, because I don't want to spend too much time playing all of these. I don't want this video to get, like, extremely long. So, maybe just 5 minutes for each game mode if I decide to play all 6 of them. Alright, so here we are in the domination game mode on Hamburger Hill. This does look pretty simple, actually. Got a few, uh, spawn points that I need to capture. Yeah, the yellow team is all the way over here. You can see them with their yellow Darwinians. We have to capture every spawn point to win the game. Yeah, so there's a bunch of them. Okay, yeah, so... I can actually choose a color for my Darwinians. So my Darwinians are cyan. Alright. That's pretty interesting. We can press the spacebar when we are ready to begin the game. And we are ready to begin the game, so let's go and do this then. So basically, the way this game works, yeah, we do have five minutes, so what we can do is that we can left-click and hold to select Darwinians, which, why is that not working exactly? Oh, okay, I guess we need to wait for uh, some Darwinians to actually spawn here. Yeah, these spawn points will occasionally uh, 
spawn Darwinians. So I guess we need to wait for them. So we can take these 20 right here. We can uh, left click and hold to actually select them. Then we can right click to uh, direct them to a point. So if we want them to go to this spawn point, we just uh, right click and drag all the way over here. Well, we left click and hold and then when we select them, we can drag it all the way over here and they'll, they'll go over this way. So then we're gonna go and capture that spawn point. We do also have a crate drop, and they're actually right next to the crate, so I think they will go and, uh, and, uh, pick it up, uh, immediately. They- the Darwinians do things automatically, for the most part. Like, whenever they're near a crate, they'll capture it automatically, and also when they are, uh... Actually, hang on a second, that's- that's not what I want to do. Uh, you can right-click on a Darwinian to turn him into an officer, but I don't- I didn't quite want to- want to do that, so I'm just gonna get rid of him for now. Yeah, so they're gonna capture the crate automatically, it takes a little while to- to float down. But in the meantime, though, I am going to try and capture some of the other spawn points, because I really need to. Because I'm- I'm wasting too much time focusing on this. Yeah, so they're capturing the crate automatically. Also, the Darwinians will attack the other team automatically as well, and they attack them with simple little lasers. Wait, slow down? What do, what do you mean, slow down? What what am I doing? Did- 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 did you guys use something on me? Did the yellow team use- use some sort of thing on me? Or was that the crate? Okay, maybe- it might have actually been the crate. Okay, they're going to that spawn point over there. I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna let them do that. Oh, wait. Everything is slowed down, actually. Including these guys and even the timer. Okay, I think everything went back to normal now. Yeah. Also, the timer does count down pretty slowly, too, because it doesn't count down in real time, I noticed. Okay. Well, you guys... Now that we have this spawn point, they are gonna spawn Darwinians anyway, so you guys just go over there for now. We gotta try and get you over here. Yeah, so this is basically how the combat works right here. They will attack automatically. I don't think there's any way you can make them attack manually. Or you can attack manually, I should say. So as you can see, they just fire simple little lasers, and they do get vaporized if they uh, take a lot of damage. So we're gonna see if we can possibly try to get this spawn point back. They do occasionally throw grenades as well. Oh, we got the rocket turret. Oh, that's good then. That's very nice, actually. Uh, where should we where should we place this? Place it on on top of the mountain, perhaps? Yeah, there we go. Place a rocket turret so we can annihilate them with rockets. Very nice indeed. As for you guys, I'm gonna bring you over to this spawn point over here. Okay, it's getting a little bit hectic now. We're kinda, kinda going into a war zone right here. Oh, jeez, okay. Yeah, we do have four spawn points right now, so I am actually winning. Uh, what should I do with you guys? You know what? You go, you go and take, uh, take care of it. Wait, yellow gets rocket winnians? Oh, jeez. What is going on here? Oh, their, their Darwinians are firing rockets themselves. Oh, crap, okay. Uh, well, hang on a second, there is an officer over here. Um, okay, you know what? Fine, fine then. Fine then. Uh, actually, hang on a second. Maybe, maybe I should do something with you guys here. Create an officer and I'll go with, like, some sort of formation if they try to attack this area right here. I, I guess. I mean, I can bring them over here as well, but... No, I'm just gonna press the spacebar to deselect them. Okay, what is this Darwinian doing over here? Um, okay. I need to do something with you guys, I really do. I need to get you over to there, because there's not that many of these guys over there anyway, so take take care of that, please. Oh god. Okay, hang on a, hang on a moment. There's a lot of guys coming, o coming over there. Holy crap, dude. They're taking over so many spawn points. Uh, yeah, just go and, go and get that one. Yeah, and I'm also losing my spawn points, too. This trooper right over here is just, is just collecting my crate. Okay, collecting the crate for me, I mean. Oh my god, dude. Come on here. I mean, this is my first time playing the game, after all, so I mean, I'm not- I'm not that good at this. This is only my first time playing it, but hopefully... I mean, I do have my- my formation up, so hopefully it can- it can stop them. They have so many officers, though. Okay, I should create an officer for- for these guys, then, and create some sort of formation around here. There. You guys create the formation, and hopefully the rocket turret can- can hold them off for long- for long enough. There, are one one minute remaining. What did I get? I'm not even sure what I got. Uh, oh my god. Okay, hang on a second. Yeah, here- here comes the rocket turret. There we go. Does seem like it is destroying the Darwinians pretty- pretty fast. Oh, that's- that's good, actually. That's really nice. Um, I gotta do something about these guys over here. I gotta take them over there, somehow. Maybe I can move you. I can move you over to here. Hang on a second. Well, I don't want to make two more officers, but... Okay, well, we have the slowdown again. Hang on. Go- go that way. And there's not that many of them over here right now, so before this one spawns too many of them, 
Maybe I can get over there. Well, I don't know. There's only 19 seconds remaining. I think it may be hopeless. I think it might honestly be hopeless, because I don't think I'm going to have enough time to be able to do that. There's a crate all the way over here, but that that entire area is guarded by the yellow guys. Okay. And maybe in that case... Okay, I really don't want to keep keep selecting officers here. I'm trying to... Oh, because what I'm doing is that I'm, I'm left-clicking. Okay, hang... Or I'm not left-clicking, I should say. Okay, guys, go go over there. There's like 247 of you. Okay, well, that's, that's just it. So at least you guys already know how much I suck at this. Had like hundreds of Darwinians that I could have possibly used to annihilate these guys over here. Didn't use it to my advantage. But I mean, at least you guys know how the game works. And I'm not, uh, you know, not not trying to win these battles anyway. This is my first time ever playing Multiwinia, after all. So, yeah, I guess I guess that's it for domination then. Jeez, these maps really do load very quickly. So yeah, occupy key zones to score points every second. This is something that the tutorial taught me. Um... I don't know if it taught me about this structure right here, but yeah, there's a bunch of spawn points that we can try and secure and try and keep those keep those zones. Gotta get those zones in our in our area right over here. Okay, so in that case, maybe I can upgrade you to an officer already, and I can take you over there, like immediately, and tell you guys. Oh yeah, well the officer himself doesn't actually go to uh that that point. Yeah, that's right, because the officer is there to uh guide the multi-winions over to there, like, ordering them to go to this, to this point over here. Okay, well then I need to, I need to pay attention to the other ones then. Uh, in that case, you guys can go over here and try and secure that, that zone as well. Oh jeez, okay, hang on a second. Where's, where is the crate dropping? It's dropping over there. Okay, we're about to get into some sort of war zone here, boys. Well, there's only, like, one, one Darwinian right here, and he's just, he's just fleeing. Okay, well you just stay there for now. Uh, actually, okay, hang on a second. I don't want to turn you into an officer. Uh, what exactly do I do I want to do over here? Yeah, you know what? Maybe when you guys get to this to this zone right over here, try and capture one of these spawn points. Yeah, because I assume that is a, a spawn point over there. So you guys, go and capture this. Please and thank you. And uh, some of you over here... Well, hang on a second. I'm going to wait for them to capture that. Uh, there's more Darwinians over here, actually, so... You guys go capture that spawn point if you possibly can, so we can create some more some more Darwinians. How's this battle over here going? Uh, seems like it's going fine for now. Uh, okay, these guys are gonna start getting getting some points though, so I'd have to maybe try and go and get rid of that spawn point or capture that one. Okay, hang on a second, guys. You, oh god, jeez, why is the game lagging so much? Um, you go over there and maybe try to capture that spawn point, even though there's really not that many of you at all. But we'll just see here. I mean, I am in the lead right now. Uh, you guys go and follow them, because there's only like 20 of them and I don't trust them. Okay, they're already going for that spawn point, though, but maybe you guys can take them out. Maybe you guys can take them out. Okay, they open the crate. Yeah, they're opening all sorts of crates here. I love the smell of napalm in the morning. Oh god. Plague outbreak. Also, I just realized that I didn't set the timer to, uh... I, I didn't set the timer to five minutes, I forgot to. Okay, whoa, whoa, hang on a second, what is going on here? What is going on here? I'm just setting all my Darwinians on fire. What the heck? Okay, go go over this way, please. Are, are you guys taking them out? No, you have, like, an officer over there. Okay, hang on, hang on a moment. Should I, should I go into, into a formation? Well, I don't know, the reds seem to be outnumbered anyway. So, maybe, maybe I can just keep them the way they are, I don't know. Excuse me? What is, what is this symbol supposed to be? I don't understand. Is it like some sort of boat? Or a ship? I don't, I don't understand what that does. Um, anyway, I restarted the game, I decided to lower the, uh, lower, lower the timer to five minutes, and, I mean, I am currently winning right now, but not by a whole lot. Oh my god, dude. What is going on here? Yes, they have, they have nuclear airstrikes again. Holy crap, okay. I think, I think they took over my flame turret. I love the smell of napalm in the morning. Okay, hang on a second. Everything's going to crap very quickly, guys. I need to take control of these guys over here and maybe, maybe get them, get, get, get them over to here. God, if the game would just stop freaking out for, for one second. Yeah, I've moved to second place. I, 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 I noticed that. Yeah, but at least I got more Darwinians this time. Uh, I don't, I, I really do not know what I should do here. One, one minute remaining. Go back there and try to try to get the flame turret. I think they I think they overthrew it. Yeah, because look at all the Darwinians we have right now. Guys, like go go back over there and, and kill them, please. 
I mean, we have we have tons of you guys. We can do this. I'm pretty sure we can take them out very easily. Uh, these guys are in formations, though. I guess I can promote one of you to officer, and you guys can just stay in formation over here. I guess. I guess we could we could arrange that, but oh god, oh god, what do I do? What do I do? Yeah, these guys took took over over here. Yeah, see, the problem is that these guys have flamethrowers, though. Because they took over my flame turret. Okay, well, I mean... Oh, God. Okay, well, you have some sort of crate here. Can you capture this quickly and see what we have? Future Winians? Don't, don't know what that is. I have no clue what that is at all. Blue runs hot feet. Uh, okay. I don't know what that means either, but could you... Could you... Could you do something? Could you guys please go and do something? Well, you're not going to be able to do anything because it's too late now. Blue team already won. Alright. How did they manage to take over my flame turret so quickly? I'm pretty sure I saw my own Darwinians get in there. Um, well, that's what I get for not strategizing. I mean, I don't know, it looked like these guys were doing rather well. Looks like they were launching grenades at them and destroying the blues pretty quickly, but still didn't work out in my favor. I mean, at least, at least I tried. Should have gone over to this side. Yeah, because I guess you need to be, you need to be quick about what, about what you're doing. Not only that, I had so many Darwinians that I could have possibly used as well. Alright, now we're gonna get into the interesting game mode. So this is Capture the Statue. Lift heavy statues back to your home base to score points. This does appear to be one of the statues. Oh, it's the Shattered Sphere from Darwinia. Okay, my Darwinians are like right next to it, so I can just go immediately for it. Um, okay. So, I have to take it to this circle, I assume? Those are the circles of the other Darwinians. I guess there's going to be another statue that spawns here. Yeah, this is uh, a map called Melting Pot. So this is a three-team map right over here. We do have greens and yellows that we need to worry about as well. So I guess we'll just get started then in that case. All right, let's begin this game then. Okay, well, let's do it. Okay, so first of all, get you guys over here. Just go to this, go to the statue immediately. I assume this is the one we have to go for first, and then maybe these guys will... And, it, like, I I mean, after we capture that statue, then maybe the other one will spawn right here. I'm, I'm thinking, promote one of you guys to, to officer, and just, uh, make you guys go over... Okay, yeah, there's already a new statue. Okay, but it's over, it's over on the other side, though, so you guys just stay here and, uh, defend, defend the spawn point. Alright, well, you guys go and try to get, get this statue here. How do you even capture this, this statue anyway? Uh... How, how, like, how exactly do you do this? I don't- I don't quite under- understand how this works. Okay, hang on a second. Are you- are you guys actually picking up the statue? Because I'm not- I'm not quite sure how- how you do this. Uh... Oh no, they're- they're moving the statue. Okay, well hang on a second. The- the reinforcements are- are starting to arrive. Guys, you might wanna- you might- you might wanna try going- going over there, perhaps. Yeah, because they see us. Come on. Hurry- hurry up, for goodness sakes. Can only take care of one statue at a time. Okay, that other statue is is up now. Actually, go go to it before the greens get to it. Come on, guys, hurry up, hurry up for goodness sakes. There, just put try and push them back because they have they have grenade launchers. Come on, go push them back for goodness sakes. And in the meantime, try to go in and get rid of these these idiots over here. Thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed. Wait, is this uh? Okay, yeah, this is this is one of my guys. He looked like a different color for a moment. Yeah, I just need to get you back to my statue, or to my my base right over here. Some other guys defending their their home base here. Okay, yeah, we need to try and kill these guys, but there's a bunch of a bunch more of them coming over. So maybe I can take. Oh my god, dude! Why is the game lagging so much? Yellow causes a meteor shower. Well, that isn't that just fantastic? Isn't that just fantastic? Where's that gonna go exactly? Oh yeah, sure, goes right to my home base. Yeah, because what? Where else would it go? Okay, come on here. They're, they're invading my base here, for goodness sakes. Also, everything is slowing down again. Come on here. I mean, we are here, aren't we? Please, do something. Okay, yeah. We, we captured the statue. I don't know why the game freaked out when we did that, but... Okay, yellow captured the statue. Okay, we got that statue back from them, at the very least. Um, green runs personal shield. Oh god, there's not a lot of a lot of guys spawning over here. What are you guys doing? Just going and, and, def and trying to kill these guys. Just getting yourselves annihilated by grenades. I see. I see. Oh my god, dude. There's like an army of greens. Come on here. Guys, please. Hang on. You, over here. Go, go, try and de defend these guys. Where are all my other 
blues anyway, or my scions. I mean, they're all over here trying to defend this, this point, but you know what? You, you need to go and help these guys over here. Okay, yeah, because they just dropped the statue, come on. You guys gotta go. You guys gotta go. Okay, hang on a second, maybe I need to, I need to reform here for a moment. Because you're, you're standing on the Syed. Look, look over this way, please. Yes, turn, turn around, for goodness sakes. We're all fighting for this one statue right over here. Yellow and me are the only ones who actually scored points right now. Yeah, and the green, the greens are, are starting to get that statue back over there, but... I want to try and get this one first. Okay, they're going back and getting that statue. Okay, you know what? You know what? Take you, and just, just tell them to go over there and try and nab that statue. Okay, is it sending the formation over, though? Okay, I guess, I guess the, the officer is going with the formation. Okay, that's not quite what I told you to do. Oh, wow, okay. That's convenient. It's actually right next to, uh, where we're supposed to take it. Guys, come on, can you... Holy jeez, dude. You stop with all the meteor strikes or whatever the heck you're doing? Gotta try and pick this up here. Mega Rage? Uh, I don't know what that is, but I don't like it. I really do not like it. Okay, guy is... Please just go and... Where, 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 where? Where do I even take this? Where would I even put you guys? Uh, I'm not, I'm not even sure. I don't know. I guess in case another statue spawns, take care of those guys over there. I guess. Um, okay. As for you guys, you can all go and try and take this statue back over here. And make it snappy, please. Because we're running out of time here. One minute remaining. We're all tired right now. Oh my god, see, the greens are starting to take it back. Go, quickly. Quickly, go and take it. You guys go over there with them as well. Oh my god, dude. They're so slow, for goodness sakes. Oh my god, there's, this is like a three-way battle royale going on over here. Oh my god, are they are they even gonna get close to it? Okay, well, yellow captured another statue. Yes, I'm tied for second. Okay, well, I get, never mind, because we were, we were way too frigging slow. Uh, yeah, try and capture this one over here. There's only like one Darwinian. Where are all my Darwinians going anyway? Guys, just go go try to capture this statue over here. Or not the statue, but the crate. I mean, we were very close to getting that one. Can we can we destroy the engineer? Yeah, as you can see, the engineers are back, but that's that's Yellow's engineer though. Um Okay. You guys go get this crate. It's probably gonna be completely pointless anyway, considering we're about to run out of time here, but uh I mean, it's just maybe worth a shot. Yeah, new statue, but we're not gonna have time for that. Oh wait, sudden death? Uh, okay, yeah, I guess sudden death against against green and yellow, considering they're tired, but not not for me though. Yeah, my my spawn points have been deactivated. Crate mania. Whoa, hang on a second. Okay, hang on, hang on. Maybe maybe I can come back. Maybe I can come back here. Hold on a moment. Okay, never mind. Green green captured a statue, so it's not even not even any point now. Okay. I didn't know that could happen. Yeah, if only the game didn't didn't end so quickly, though. Like, like as soon as it happened, the game just ended. Okay. I really don't understand why the game keeps freezing, but... This seems to be more more unstable than, than Darwinia. And Darwinia was not unstable at all. Okay, well, I captured one statue. I, I at least feel like I accomplished something. Right, well, let's try out the Assault game mode, then. Now, this one does appear to have different rules than all the other game modes. Apparently, we're, de we're defending a, me a weapon of mass destruction against waves of incoming attackers. And also, I can't change the uh, the timer for this one, so it's set to 15 minutes. Okay, hi, hi guys. You just, you just suddenly popped out of nowhere. Okay, yeah. So this does give me the opportunity to show off the armor, because that right there is the armor. And, okay, wow, the game is, like, really lagging now. What the heck? Okay, yeah, but basically this armor right here, it's kind of like a ship. You can direct the uh, Darwinians where to go. They also get in the ship as well. These radar dishes, um, well, I don't know. I mean, you, you can use the radar dishes normally to teleport to other locations on the island, but I guess, I don't know, maybe you can't do it for these ones because it doesn't really seem like you can. All right, well... Where, where should I go and, and take this, then? Where, where should I tell this to go? Uh, I mean, we do have a bunch of walls over here. Uh, yeah, we're trying to defend this UFO, by the way. I'm trying to fight over this UFO here. Um, where are the attackers, anyway? I can't, I can't tell where they are. Oh, they're over here. Okay, hang on a second. Maybe, maybe get the, get the welcoming committee over here. Now, I don't know, is the, is the armor gonna fly over... That, uh, that shield right over here? 
I really hope it does. Uh, oh, it flies through the shield. Okay, n never mind, I guess. Whoa, hello. What's going on over here? So many Darwinians on fire. Oh, okay. I guess I have I have bases set up over here as well. Okay, reinforcements in 40 seconds. Okay. Uh, no. Maybe I should tell maybe I should tell them to go a little bit a little bit further. Yeah. Maybe maybe I will just do that. Yeah, because there's there's no enemies over here. Game, please. What are you doing? Holy crap. Yeah. Okay. You can you can just face through walls. Uh, yeah, because that that makes total sense. Um. Well, there is a crate drop over here, actually. Uh, you know what? Go fa Fall back for just a moment. I want you to go and get this crate, actually. Yeah, just go back and get the crate for a moment. Uh, I don't know if... Uh, holy jeez, dude. Okay, hang on a second. The The reds are, are coming quickly. Hang on a second. Get 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 out of the uh, the armory. Actually, how can I how can I do this again? Can I can I tell them to get out? I know there's there's definitely a way to tell them to abandon ship. Yeah, okay. Go and get the, the crate for me, quickly, please. And then get back in the armory, because the, the boys are approaching. The boys are fast approaching. Okay, crate mania. Um, okay, yeah, get get back in the ship. Leave. We gotta, we gotta get the heck out of Dodge here. Hang on a second. Did they... Oh, yeah, they are starting to take over my my stuff over here. Okay, that's that's not really, really that good. Um... Yeah. Okay. We're just gonna we're just gonna fall fall back for now. Maybe well maybe just fall back over here, and then maybe we can create an officer. We can create a formation right here. Assume assume the formation. Just gonna leave those guys behind to try and fight them because because why the heck not? Why the heck not? Yeah. There's another crate over that way too. Yeah. And it seems like these Darwinians are actually manning the the turrets over here. Okay. So you guys you guys get out get out for now. Go and man these these turrets over here. I'll turn one of you into uh, an officer and create a formation right around here, I guess. Yeah, I think that would be good. There. So we have a little bit of a formation set up right next to these uh, to these turrets over here. Also, uh, take this one Darwinian over here just so that he doesn't get killed. Go back, go back over this way, please. Go back over that way. Wait, are you guys even even trying to attack attack my base? Where where are you even going? I mean, there are some guys over here. I guess those are spawn points. Yeah, that's that's the radar dish over there. Because all of the uh, Darwinians are getting in there and they're teleporting over to this side. Yeah, so that's how the that's how the radar dishes work. Okay, they open the crate. What what exactly? Okay, a nuke barrage? Where Where is that going exactly? Okay, no, boys, boys and girls, boys and girls, retreat immediately. Retreat immediately. Holy crap. Okay, well, I guess the officers are, are just going to die. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Um, well, I mean, that's directly targeting the turrets, so I don't I don't know if they're going to survive. I really do not know. Okay, guys, I really do want you to get away from that. Uh, wait, where, where is the nuke exactly? I don't, I don't even see it. Uh, yeah, there, there is no nuke. There is no nuke, so I don't, I don't, I don't see it anywhere. Is it, is it going to hit my turrets, or... Okay, ant's nest? I, I do not know what is even happening anymore. Um, yeah, you guys just stay over there, I guess, if they if they somehow break through the defenses. Okay, yeah, they can destroy the turrets, though. Okay, well, in that case, maybe maybe I do need a formation set up right here, just, just in case. I mean, there's a lot of these guys, though. So, okay, well, I should definitely take advantage of, of you guys over here, because there's so many of you. Yeah, I need I need to make you guys go in and do something. Make yourselves useful. Okay, yeah, there's, there's the nukes right there. Oh yeah, the nukes are just like outlines. Oh my god. Maybe the reason the game's lagging so much is because there's so much crap going on the screen. Yeah. There's just so much crap going on. So much garbage. Um, oh wait. Why are, why are these turrets down as well? Well, I don't think they're down, but it looks like they're taking damage. Okay. I mean, I don't know how to play this. This is only my first time playing this game mode. Uh, great. Well, I mean, you guys should probably, should probably just go and stay there. Uh, you guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you guys go over to this crate here, because I want to pick this up as fast as I possibly can. Please. For the love of God. Oh my God. What the heck? There's so many of them, for gonna say this, because they, like, spawn them out so quickly, too. Okay, this is, this is gonna be, like, a battle for this crate right here, because both of them are going in. Who's gonna collect the crate? Who is gonna collect the crate first? Well, there's definitely gonna be a battle for it, but we're gonna, we're gonna see how it goes. Alright, guys, come on, please. 
And there's not a whole lot of guys coming out of the portal over there. Okay, yeah, they're, they're trying to get it, but can we try and, and kill them here? Oh my god, dude. There's there's too many of them. There's like a giant, a giant army of them over here. There's no way in heck we're gonna be able to defeat that. Especially not when they have grenades. Oh god, the Mega Rage. Um, okay. I really, I really don't know what I should be doing right now. You know what? I don't think this is a good decision, like, at all, but... Can some of you guys go and get this crate over here before before it disappears? Please, please, and thank you. There we go. Just go over here. I don't know why, but for some reason it spawned behind the UFO. Uh, yeah, there's there's another crate. They've already gotten that one. Yeah, they're taking control of these of these turrets over here. Cause there's a not not that many of these Darwinians controlling these uh these these turrets over here. And not only that, but all of the okay, they're already causing a meteor shower. Yeah, not not only that, but it's like they're all the crates are spawning outside my base here. Okay, well, the, that crate's already gone, so there's there's no reason for you, for you guys to do this now. Oh my god, do it. What is happening right now? Just launching an all-out assault on my base here. Okay, wait. What are you guys firing at? Are you firing at the, the meteors? Or are you guys firing inside my base? You need to be aiming at these fools over here. What the heck are you doing? Yeah, there's another, there's another island over here that these guys are, are patrolling. But, I mean, okay, why did I lose focus of the game window? Get back, please. Um, yeah. What, what is the point of this, though? I really don't understand. Okay, well, I guess I guess these guys are just gonna try and attack both of my 1,000 kills. Is, is 1,000 kills for me or for the other team? I don't, I don't quite know. Um, you know what, guys? I don't really have any interest in, uh, playing the rest of this game mode, honestly, so I think I'm just gonna... I think I'm just gonna move on to the next one because I already know I'm going to I'm going to lose this. I don't understand how this game mode works, so I'm just gonna move on. Right, so I didn't bother playing the rest of Assault mode because I frankly do not like that game mode at all. Rocket Riot seems very interesting though. This one you need to be the first team to refuel and launch your rocket. So I'm on a map here called Stairway to Heaven. Oh my god, dude. Why are there so many this is this is like on a on a giant mountainside right over here. How exactly am I am I supposed to do this? I don't quite understand, but I guess we'll we'll figure it out soon enough. All right, ready to go. Reinforcements, armor, and gun turret. Okay, capture solar panels to begin refueling the rocket. Oh, okay. All right. Oh wait, I'm not even on the correct side. This is the blue team side. Uh, wait, where where are my guys? Uh, oh, they're over here. Oh, I see you. I see you guys. Okay. Well, place. Place a gun turret right over here. Okay, well in that case, you guys go and capture the solar panels. Okay. Well, actually, hang on a second. These aren't solar panels. No, go go over here and get get these. Take take these ones from from them. Yeah, because these aren't solar panels. This is what's connecting the the the, the fuel supply to to the rocket. If I'm not mistaken, armor. I don't think I'm gonna bother with for now until some other. Some other Darwinians spawn in here. Some more of my Darwinians. Yeah, just go and take care of these guys. Yeah, there's another crate drop. Just, just overtake, overtake this one from them. There we go. So we can try getting, getting some fuel here. Actually, no one has uh, gotten any fuel yet. Yeah, there we go. Reinforcements with, with more armor. Okay. Well, I can tell you guys to get into this one at the very least. Now, where would I want to take this one though? Where exactly would I want to? Oh wait, no, I don't want you guys to get to get out. I want you to go back in, cause I misclicked. Uh, I mean, there's some more over here. I guess go go up this way and then unload immediately. Yes, there we go. So as soon as soon as you get over there, just just unload them. Okay, they're sending another armor over that way. Um, okay, well we got that that solar panel now, so maybe we can. Oh, actually, hang on a second. These guys are are going at that automatically. Maybe go over to that? That solar panel? Are you guys unloading at all? Yeah, you're gonna- you're gonna unload and you're gonna- you're gonna take care of them. Okay. Well, please, please go and do that. Please go and do that. Does seem like blue team's already getting more fuel here. Uh, what the heck even are these trees? These trees look like they're on fire. Um... Okay, so we're gonna get more reinforcements here. Maybe I could use another armor as well. Uh, yeah. Okay, so in that case, you guys, I guess, could go into the armor again. I'm I'm really not sure what I'm even doing at this point, honestly. Yeah, I can get I can get some of you guys to go and capture the other solar panels. I need you guys to stop stop them from getting fuel. All right, 
You guys... Okay, no, don't don't get out. Don't get out here. Because I keep forgetting that I do have this selected already. You can go up... Uh, where where could you possibly go? I guess you can go up this way. Or wait, am I, am I too far away from you? Yeah, I think, I think I am too far away from you. Hang on a second. Left? Okay, well... I mean, there's, there's a crate over there. Um, hang on a second. Maybe I can... Okay, hold on. Hold on. One, one thing at a time here, alright? You go up there, and then you unload. Right? Okay. So you just, you just go up there, and then maybe I'll wait for my reinforcements to arrive, and then I'll, uh, get them to unlock the crate, and see what sort of item I get. And hopefully it's a useful item. Okay. Does seem like we are getting fuel, though, finally. Uh, not at a very fast rate. These guys are actually getting fuel a lot quicker than I am. It's not good at all. Really not good at all. Holy jeez. They're trying to burp and talk at the same time. There we go. Let's get these get these guys out of here. Um, wait, where did my other armor go? Did it, did it already... Did it already... Okay, well, I did, I did get the crate open. A new, yeah. Okay, I think my armor's only arriving now. Okay, well, I mean, did it, did it get destroyed? Uh... Oh right, it, it's the it's the one up this way. Um, is there any point that I na that I have to nuke? I guess maybe over this way. I can just go and annihilate you guys. Yeah, because you guys are trying to take these these back over here. Actually, maybe I should have pointed it at you guys instead. Um, yeah. So as for you, I'll go have you attack the other guys over here. Holy crap, dude! They're getting fuel so much quicker than I am. There's another crate over here. Yeah, because that's at a that's at a very good area. It's like right on the side of a cliff. Um, I don't know if I should go and kill kill these guys over here. Okay, yeah, this is fuel for my rocket over here. Okay, yeah, I got another armor reinforcement. Which I should definitely go and, uh, put you guys in. Okay, wait a second, why is this one transparent? Is, is this, like, cloaked or something? I, I don't even understand. Okay, uh, where do I, where do I want to take you guys? Okay, game, please. Okay, maybe I want to take you guys over here. Hang on a second. Why are, why are you guys going, going back over here? Well, because I guess you guys are getting are getting more reinforcements, but still, I need to need to take this back from you guys. Um, what about over here? I mean, there's really not a, not a bunch of good things happening over here, except for except for maybe that. Um, hang on a second. No, you know what I want to do? I want to go and and get these back, right? So you guys will just go and unload over there. It's always a good feeling when you have no clue what the hell you're doing, guys. It really is. I mean, there's. N there's not that many tutorials in this game. There's only like two different tutorials in the entire game, and it doesn't it doesn't even teach you about all of these mechanics. Like the mechanics it, te it teaches you about for the most part are the King of the Hill game modes and domination, capturing the spawn points, uh, securing a certain part of the map, and just staying there in order to earn points, and also the radar dishes as well, and some of the uh, crates, like the upgrades that you can that you can get. But I mean. It, it doesn't explain all this to you, capturing solar panels so you can fuel your rocket. Oh, I see. So, after they refuel their rocket, the passengers need to get inside. Oh, okay. So then, then they can go and, uh, and escape, I guess. Well, we're not gonna, we're not gonna let that happen. Not today. Not today we're gonna let that happen. Yeah, so all the passengers need to board first, but we're gonna try and kill them as, as fast as we possibly can here. Um, I mean, there is no other armory we can get. Can't, is there? Well, I mean... Guys, go go and get that crate. Go and get that crate, please. Uh, okay, this guy is just is just freaking out because he's on a slope. Uh, we do have a gun turret though. Where can we where can we put this? Where can we put this? Uh, what about what about over here? What about over here? So someone someone can man this. Okay. Yeah. Then we have crate mania because of course it has to happen near the end of the game. Oh wow. This guy has a uh, very good aim. He's hitting uh, literally no one, even though they're like they're like three feet in front of him. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, there's not even anyone coming coming to the uh, the rocket over there. It still just says four passengers. So I guess somehow they need to make their way to the top. Oh, okay. I see the other passengers boarding. Um, okay, so how exactly do they climb into the rocket? Uh, oh, they just go into, into these things over here? Yeah. They go into this little this little opening right here. Okay, yeah, they're sending the armory up there. That's that's why. That's what's happening. Okay, go and pick up that crate. Uh, yeah, the blues are still over there. Um, let's see. What can I possibly do with with all of you guys here? Uh, I really don't know. I'm gonna try and and select as many of you as I possibly can. 
I'm really not sure what I'm even doing at this point, guys. I just really don't even know. I am gonna try out the, uh, the Blitzkrieg game mode, and then I think after that we are, we are definitely gonna be done. Because I don't, I don't feel like <laughs> playing this anymore. Because I just don't know what I'm doing in any of these game modes. Alright, get the crate, please. Is it something good? Please tell me it's something good. Ant nest? Vicious ants will attack anything that moves? Well, place it over there. So we can get rid of these, these guys. Please? Is, is that gonna do anything at all? Oh yeah. You got like tiny little ants. That, that go and eat the Darwinians. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> they actually go in and pick them up and bring them back to their nest. Okay. That's, that's kind of funny. This guy trying to run away, but nope. He's, he's too fast. Or, he's too slow, I should say. So the ants got him. You're too slow for the ants. Alright, and, oh my god, dude. Is that, is that me throwing grenades, or is it, or is it them? I can't even tell anymore. Um, just, just try and, and get them, get them away. There we go. Just launch you guys over there. And there's, there's more of them. Uh, I'm not getting any more armors, though. That's the only, that's the only problem, but maybe that way, perhaps. What else am I, am I doing over here? I'm gonna try and do something about this. Go over there. It does look like my, my guys did finally take over this, uh, this tower. Well, not quite, because there's still one missing. What the heck? You there. You there. Go and, go and capture this tower, please. There's still, like, one guy missing. Does seem like we're, we are getting fuel a lot quicker, though, because they're slowing down, but I don't think it's gonna matter anyway, because, I mean, their rocket is almost completely boarded, so, I mean, not really gonna work now. Okay, I think my ant nest is working, is working against me. Hang on a second. Why are you, why are you guys shooting at the ant nest? I thought this was, like, this would have been passive because I'm the one who placed it. Uh, okay. I, I guess it isn't. Flame turret? Yes, I, I would definitely like that, please. Blue's rocket's preparing for launch. Oh, God. Uh, put this right here, please. Put this right here. Okay. Well, the only problem is that my guys need to board it. Yeah, so that, it's just, it's just gone because of that. So that was, that was a good decision on my part, guys. Lift off in eight. Seven. You know what? We'll just, we'll just watch it. We'll, we'll just watch it here. Crate Mania. Yeah, again, always pick the great time to initiate Crate Mania when the game is literally about to end. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, well, fine. Let's just watch the rocket lift off then, guys. Watch it lift off. Zero. Here we go. Lift off. They're gonna, they're gonna fly all the way to the moon here, guys. At least we're getting more fuel, but like I said, it's, it's really not gonna matter anymore. Yep. Game over. Blue's the winner. I really don't understand why the, why time stops when, uh, I win or lose a game. Like, when the match is over, time just stands still. I don't, uh, quite understand why it does that exactly, but, uh, okay. So, another game that I, that I completely suck at. And I guess the last game we'll, we'll try out here is Blitzkrieg, so we have to capture all flags to knock our enemies out. Alright, well, we do have a gun turret down, so I guess we'll place it right down there. Yeah, right next to my base, so at least we have one guy controlling it. There we go. So should we put some some guys in in the armor over here? Yeah, the armory. Sure. Red is already under threat, and the game just began. What the heck? Okay. Whatever. Let's just let's just go and uh, where where actually where should we go? Should we go and remove these guys first? Yeah, maybe maybe we can. We can try getting their solar panels. Maybe try disabling their solar panels, perhaps. Which I guess we can try doing. Um, there is another flag that we can take over there. But I do need to wait for reinforcements to uh, arrive, though. Oh my god, dude. Really don't understand why the game is, like, freezing so much. What is happening right now? There we go. Just drift over, over the water. Or just float over the water. There we go. So we can get rid of these guys very easily and we take over their solar panels. We can possibly do that. What is going on over here? Some sort of battle initiating? Oh, there's definitely a battle initiating over here, guys. Okay. We have more armor, though. My guys are about to are about to go down now. Okay, why am I under threat? Hang on. What is what is what is going on here? Why why exactly am I under threat? Because I'm trying to kill these guys, or I I don't I don't understand. Unless some guy is is trying to go for me. Okay, hang on a second. Get in the armor, guys. I'll I'll guide you where to go. Hang on a moment. There we go. Get that and. Go over here and try to get the flag back. It doesn't seem like anyone's guarding this at all. Yeah, because the greens are, are going over this way. Well, they're... Actually, no, they're just kind of standing around. Okay, why wouldn't they be going for this flag? This flag hasn't been captured yet. Um, actually, maybe a better idea is, is try to capture this flag, considering it hasn't been captured yet. Uh, wait for more reinforcements, maybe. 
Yellow's also under threat here, but... Here, just, just try and, and capture this, because I don't know where greens are going. They think, they think they're think they safe, but they, they really aren't, because I'm about to capture one of their flags here. Uh, oh, okay, it's because this guy's coming over here, that's why, that's why. Okay, in that case, maybe I should, I should consider doing this instead. Set up another gun turret. There we go. So we can use that as a, as a defense, as a line of defense. And as for you guys, um, I mean, I don't know, where, where could I bring you? I guess I could I could try bringing you over there. Yeah, I uh, I understand my base is under attack. I have my gun turrets though. We can we can kill them. We can kill all of them. I I hope. Uh, yeah. Well, I mean, a lot of them a lot of them are dying. I think they're trying to take over my gun turrets here, but I think we we might be okay. Oh wait, I forgot to tell these guys to unload. Crap. There. K get the flag, guys. Get the flag. There we go. Bring it down. Bring it down. Um, these guys are standing on the side of a mountain. Because, uh, that's totally how physics works. Oh yeah, and they're so somehow climbing up it. What are you guys doing? That's not what I'm telling you to do. At all. I think my gun turrets are a little bit damaged, but other than that... Yeah, my base my base is fine for now. Um, it still doesn't seem like anyone's going over here. Okay, hang on a second. What are you guys doing? Go, go over here. I'm not telling you to go over the mountain, for goodness sakes. Okay, hang on a second. There's only like two minutes remaining right here. You guys still haven't finished capturing all of this. Yeah, because they're still they're still trying to kill these these guys over here. Come on, I got I gotta guide them to it, or maybe I won't be able to. Oh my god, dude! Come on here! Oh my god, the greens the greens are coming back. The lean, mean, and greens. Also, the game is is getting destroyed in the process, which is which is just fantastic. Here, someone someone take control of this again, please. Is or is it just gone? No, it's it's fine. It's fine. Okay. Um. Oh boy, the greens are coming back. To take what they rightfully own. Uh, not gonna let that happen. Cannot let that happen. Or, or wait. They're actually going past us. Yeah, they are going past us. Okay. Well, these guys are coming back, though, but I don't know. Well, it does seem like we have pretty equal numbers. But, uh, well, they have grenades. But I think I have grenades as well, so... Okay, what should I do with you guys in the meantime? I really don't know... Oh wait, these guys already got this back over here. Okay, well there's not not enough of my guy is at all that I can really do anything about that. But I can at least try. Here, go go over this way. Okay, I guess they're they're going around the other way. What is even happening? Guys, please. Okay, did you did you get rid of green over here? Okay, how ex how exactly are you guys missing? Okay, yeah, there. He's he's dead. He's dead. Raise raise the flag back up, please. I'm not even sure if we're winning right now. Uh, frankly, I have no clue what's happening. You guys go and get that crate, too. Um, I mean, we're just kind of relaxing right here. Yeah, we're, we're hiding somehow. How do you guys not even see each other? God, I don't understand how these Darwinians behave in this game. I really don't. Do not understand what's going on here. Um, okay, there's there's more guys coming, coming over here. Okay, hang on a second. Could you guys actually go to them? Like, get right up close in their face, please? I got a napalm strike. Well, I'll place it right there. Place it right there. There we go. Disperse them. Disperse them. Get them Get them out of that area. Okay, well, I mean... <laughs> yeah, we're all under threat. Uh, okay, green one. Okay. So, that's 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 the end of that, I guess. Yeah, because I guess they I guess they had more flags than, than we did. How many part bases did they capture? Uh, looks like they captured three in total. Uh, yellow, I think, captured two... Uh, I think red captured two as well, and I captured two. Okay, so I guess I guess everyone else was just tied then. Well, this one was coming down as the yellows were were trying to destroy them, but I don't know. Would that still count as 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 reds obtaining that? I I don't quite know. I don't quite know, and I don't quite care anymore because I think I'm done with this game because I suck at it. And I don't want to play it anymore because of that. Well, no, the main reason I want to stop playing this game is because I've been recording it for a very long time. As a matter of fact, I've been recording this for, like, almost an hour. Um, I don't know if the video I end up uploading is going to end up being this long. I'm probably going to cut a lot of this stuff out, though. I don't think I'm going to keep, like, all of the uh, raw footage that I recorded in here. I don't think I'm going to do that, guys. There's definitely going to be some parts of this that I'm going to cut out. Um, yeah, so that's Multiwinia. I mean... I, I definitely like it a lot more than Darwinia, because I do feel like it is much faster paced. I don't really need to 
wait for anything to happen. I can just start attacking other Darwinians almost immediately, it seems, but uh, I definitely still have a lot to learn about the gameplay mechanics because I still have no clue what I'm even doing. I don't really feel like the tutorials really taught me all that much about about the game either. Like, I feel like it only taught me about certain game modes, like King of the Hill and Domination, but it didn't really teach me the mechanics of the other game modes, though. You notice that there's only two parts to the tutorial, so... Kinda wish there was more parts. I wish there was, like, a part for each individual game mode, so it would teach me the basic mechanics, so I know how to play, but... Eh, whatever. I'm, I'm just done for now. If you guys want to uh, purchase Multiwinia, the link is in the description as always. I'm definitely going to try and play this game a lot more off-screen so I can get better at it, but I don't know. Maybe I should just play on easy mode for now because it seems like even normal is, is way too difficult for me. I didn't even win any games this time around, but whatever. I don't, I don't really care. I guess these asterisks right here indicate the difficulty of the game mode. Like, there's one asterisk right here, two asterisks, and three asterisks. So I guess Rocket Riot and Blitzkrieg are meant to be, like, the hardest. So yeah, still a pretty fun game either way. Just out of curiosity, are there anyone playing playing a game right now? Like, just just out of curiosity, can we can we request a game search right here? Just just to see. I, I'm very curious as to whether or not uh, Multiwinia is still being played by people. Because, I mean, the game did come out nine years ago. And it was a pretty tiny little indie game as well. I don't know, I don't think Multiwinia was that popular when it came out. Well, maybe maybe it was, but it probably isn't anymore considering it's been nine years. Uh, requesting server list? Okay, I don't think I don't think it's even going to request a server list because this is taking a really long time, so whatever. Not not gonna bother with that for now. Yeah, it's it's not doing anything, guys. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave this video here. Hope you guys still enjoyed, even though I had no clue what I was doing, like, 90% of the time, but I mean, at least I try it. I really did try to understand what I was doing, but sometimes it just, it just doesn't work out. Especially if the game doesn't give you that many tutorials to begin with, and doesn't exactly explain all of the mechanics of each and every game mode to you, but... Whatever. It's still a fun game regardless, and I'm still gonna try and learn how to play it properly so I can actually be good at it. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next video I make. Later!